install the CAN image render advanced machine on the Mac computers. First thing, we need to know what's the OS version of the Mac. So you click on the uh, Mac's Apple uh, icon, click on about this Mac. You see the Mac OS version is this computer is 10.13.6. Okay, we close it. We go into the Canon website, download the drivers. Okay, Canon.ca. Then you click on the top, contact and support. You go into business support. You scroll down. On the office printer and the fax machine, you will see Canon image running and the image render advanced multifunction printer get a support. So on the driver, you see a link to access drivers. On the product family, you click on the last one, image render advanced. Uh, this one's uh, we install the black white, so we click on the black white. So we're going to install the model is image runner advanced uh, for the 35, so it should be in this category. So the driver for the 35 is in the first one, the driver and the software. We scroll down to the bottom of the page. So all the Macintosh driver is uh, in the bottom of the page. The the version we using is 10.13.6, so it should be the last one. It's in this range. You have to agree. Then you download. Okay, um, yes, I already downloaded before, so we need to open this file. But you have a way to, to download the finish, but here we just can open the previous downloads. Okay, when you open the window, there was the offices folders here, just open. You will see uh, one of the installer package files. So you double click on it. You continue. Continue again. So you have to agree the license. So install. So you need to tap in the Passport for the <clears throat> the users for the Mac users, okay. So the Mac computer installing the printer driver into the Mac systems. Okay, after we finish install the driver, so we uh, close the the wizard. Then you can move that installing file to the charge. Okay, then after this, we need to go in to uh, install the other printer. <clears throat> okay, you're going to system preferences. Go into printer and the scanner. You click the add icon. You choose IP. You type in your printer IP address. Here's a 192.16.1.220. This one's a difference, it depends on the printer IP address. So you need to get the IP address. On the protocol, you choose HP GA Direct Socket. Then on the use, you click on the select software. Another software window come out in the filter. You just tap in your printer so, um, model numbers. I'm installing 4035 advanced 4035. So the printer job was here. Just filter and click OK. Click Add. 
Okay, here we go. We have the printed sphere. So all finished. Okay, thank you.